Well, I must say, I have attended many ceremonies to do with uh, students graduating from a university course. But I've never come across anything quite like this one. I think it has ascended to the condition of an artwork. I have never seen a chancellor of a university spend so much time in dialogue with every single student. You might think it's normal, but I can assure you it is not. Obviously, he's a true commander of uh, men <laughs> by his vocation, but he cares. I could see that in his every gesture and by the response of every student. It is a moment which is historic in the life of each human being, living the life of a student, coming to the end of student days and the beginning of a life in which the language of art will be the prime factor. Now, this university has proved to me through this ceremony today that it cares deeply, not in the idea that you should receive a degree, but that you should be creative. It is the language of art that gives us hope, that makes us human, that enables us, enables us to make contact with our fellow human beings. It is a language of art that makes sense of the mystery of human life, of birth and death, and what happens in between. I want you to know that today, I am fully aware that I'm playing the game of life in, well, when I was in my 70s, I knew it was called that game, uh, Extra Time. <laughs> But I'm now playing it in penalty shootout time. <laughs> and that's why the exhibition is to do with the number nine. But I want you to know, I hope every single one of you who've graduated today will live long enough to play the game of life in penalty shootout time, because then you'll realize your capacity to be creative really does get you through that testing time. You are born to be creative to the last breath of your life. Using the art, the language of your art, each one of you, you can make society well. You can make the life of every single individual you meet better. You can give us hope in the future. So can you imagine how I feel? The long journey I've made over 81 years to this occasion. I would say thank you to every single one of you. I couldn't believe that moment when each of you came to the stage and you found yourself shaking hands. But more than that, involved in a, I hope, each one of you a fruitful dialogue and a message of congratulations and hope. I'd like to add to that. <laughs> I'd like to say that's what my job is. I studied graphic design. I studied typography. I studied mural painting. But most of all, I realized that in doing that, my job was to help everyone I met in life to share my total commitment to that language which you're all about today, the language of creativity, the language of art. And so I thank you. I cannot tell you how it means to me that you have given me that exhibition, which I hope all of you can consider seriously, and that you have given me this extraordinary honor. Thank you. <laughs>